Hey there, Ventex here. Welcome to another live stream. Today we're going to be checking out some horror games. There is this developer named Vincent Lod who made quite a few different ones and I thought that'd be cool to kind of check out. They're very cheap and short, so I got three that we're going to play today. We're going to start with the Witching Hour demo, go on into The Swine, and then finish with Hawthorne. Uh, was it subscribe only mode? Then why was I not able to watch it right away, huh? I'm one of the longest. I think, <laughs> I think it's because uh, the way I scheduled it, because I did a scheduled one this time, and I think I had to press live twice in order to get it going live, like for real. So let's go ahead and get started. We're going to start with the witching hour. Yeah, it was kind of weird. I press start streaming on OBS, but then I also had to press go live on YouTube since I scheduled it. Interesting music. I don't like the that the cursor is white on a white background. That is not cool. <laughs> Graphics, ultra, yes. Film grain disabled, yes. Motion blur, yes. Good. Okay, we'll give it a little bit more time for people to start heading in. Time to play some interesting horror games. It's been a little bit. I know there's a bunch of good ones coming out soon called, like, The Mortuary Assistant and... I got a whole bunch on my wish list so far that I'm looking forward to. So I got, let's see, Mortuary Assistant, Hell Seed, that's been coming out forever. Dark Fracture, Autopsy Simulator, The Hauntings, The Outlast Trials. I'm going to turn down the music a little bit. Or not. Not's also something. Let's get into it. Maybe the music will calm down a little bit. Press any key. Okay, so... There's a door with chains and a cross on it. That's always a good sign. Got a fountain, so rich people, excellent. Marlon Dunn as the shut-in, so they have uh, their voice actors giving them credit. The game by Vincent Laud. All right. Witching Hour, this is the demo. The full game's coming out later this year, but we're gonna start with the demo and then go into the other games. Alright, press any key. And you said we never hang out. When was the last time we spent the whole day together? Continue. Where the heck is my mouse? Continue. Click. The only reason oh, there we go. I guess maybe you have to wait for the cutscene to catch up to the dialogue for right now in the demo. Because I'm clicking continue as you can see it highlight. Hey, Pablo. Oh, enter. Maybe I gotta press enter. Yeah, it's enter. They don't tell you that. I don't know. It just says Eastern Village on the town map. Looks like it's seen better days. Everything in this town is old. I hate that we live here now. What are we supposed to do if we run out of money? I may have some ideas. What? Sell me to the circus or something? Who says that? What? Sell me to the circus or something? 
us, and they have a strict no return policy. Ha ha ha. Ha ha. Can we play hide and seek? Please. We came all this way. Well, I see your clothing's a little bit scuffed. <laughs> Her jacket's a little weird. Okay, but don't go too far. It's already getting late, and we need to be back before it's dark. Does she have a scarf on underneath her jacket like that? Okay, I guess. Damn, those are some heavy footsteps. Ready or not, here I come. Start the game. Here we go. Uh, settings. Still no audio. So hopefully, I guess we'll just pray it doesn't get too loud. Alright, so Emma is hiding and we have to find her. The perfect time to start raining. We knew it was cloudy. Eastern Village. Alright. What's going on in here? Just a... A shady looking van. Very, very shady. Can I jump? No. There's a gate leading to a gate leading to a wall. Interesting. Hey, Graham. Okay, we got a little gazebo over here. With just a little single bench. A little bit of head bob in action. I don't think I can disable that. We have a grave site here. Can't make it out too well. Meister, something Meister. 1881 to 1954. Tisdale Meister or something? That's a big old angel statue. So here's the fountain that we saw at the beginning. Wow. I think, uh... That water. <laughs> that water, though. Yeah, we're playing hide-and-go-seek with our little sister, Emma. Oh, there's a door here. Looks like it's locked. Okay, well, we're not meant to go there. I like how the sidewalk just ends to another gate with another wall behind it. What's with this place and gates and walls? Why are you getting off the walls? Let's scout around outside the house before we make our way in. Looks like it's pretty dilapidated. We have a red door here. Looks like it's locked. Okay. It's not even a welcome mat. Here's another angel statue. She's like reaching up to the tree and she's got... What is this? A crowbar. Is that a crowbar? Hey, NGP. Let me try... Let's see the well. No, nothing in the well. Let's try the front of the house, and then... I don't know. Let's keep looking. Emma is around here somewhere. Oh, never mind. I can't get through this area. That's locked. Let's try to take a left here. Maybe it's this house right here. I like how you have a bridge over nothing. Like, there's not even a pond or something. It's just a random bridge. I guess in case you get tired of walking straight, you can now walk upstairs. Okay, the art's not terrible. The angel statue head starts moving, I'm leaving. <laughs> it's a weeping angel. All right, here's a way inside, hopefully. Another red door. Oh, cutscene. Can I help you? Can I help you? Oh my god. Oh, sorry. I, I didn't think anyone lived out here. He's just barging into people's houses, lady. Not many do. It's usually just people passing through. I assume you came with that girl. The one in the leather jacket. How does he know? You must be peeking, creeper. Um, yeah, that's my little sister Emma. We were just playing a stupid game. I saw her crawl under the fence of the historical society. Okay. The big house northeast of here. Northeast of here. She really shouldn't have gone in there. 
Why? Oh, thanks for telling me. I should be on my way then to go get her. Gate's locked, and you probably won't fit under the fence. But I can help you. I just need something first. Okay, what do you need? Sure. What do you need? There's a small house east of here. I'll give you the key for the front door. Something very important to me is in there. Retrieve it, and I'll help you open the Historical Society's gate. Can you do this for me? I would do it myself, but I can't. The small house. Small east house east of here. I was just there. Okay. What am I looking for exactly? Um. Hello. Hello. Pick up an abandoned house key. Oh, I got it. Okay. You see, I have like a. Oh, that's for the electricity. That's weird to have right there. Press tab. Okay, so we can see our house key right here, abandoned house key. The key to, for the front door of the small house in the village is east. So here's the eastern village. There's a parish, the pasture, and green water gardens, and then our home. Historical society, Emma's hiding in the large house. I have to get the gate open. The shut-in needs something from the other village house. All right. Well, we got the keys, so let's go ahead and head inside. Is it this one? No, it's this one. To the east. This is to the east. Maybe. Alright. We're just letting ourselves in. No big deal. Okay. There's something in here that guy wants. Shouldn't be too complicated, right? It says drag. Oh, okay, I see. This place is creepy. It's an owl. There's a light here, which makes me think someone's here, and there's an iron. Probably shouldn't be here. There's a box there. I can't get into any of the dressers. Ooh, there's a safe here. That's a huge safe. Okay, there's some kind of passcode. Ghost. Enter. No, I don't know. It says, ask the dolls. We have to ask the dolls. Oh. What was that? Must have been just the wind. Probably just the wind. No need to be alarmed. Okay, here's a kitchen. Oh, look! That, uh, figure is pointing to this guy that holds a block. I don't know what that is. Is that a T? Or is that an H? There's a toaster. Fridge with some drinks in it. Okay, interesting. Looks like it's locked. That's weird. Why would it be locked? What are we... It said, ask the dolls. Oh, here's the dolls. Oh, okay. What do I do here? Oh, you gotta move their arms according to the picture. I see. Okay. So, first one is... Let's look at this one. So, this is the plus with the circle. Left arm up, right arm down. Oh. Okay, that was me. Oh my gosh. There we go. Plus with a circle, left arm up, right arm down. Okay. Now, oh, press escape accidentally. Where is the other one? It was in here, wasn't it? Yes. So, left arm straight, right arm down. Left arm straight, 
right arm down. Okay, now we just need to find this one. Oh, I keep pressing escape. This is locked, so it's in there. Where was the other portrait? I guess there's only a so number or so many number of combinations, so we could actually probably figure it out without finding this other portrait. But if we find the portrait sooner rather than later, it'll save us time. A little bit of time. But I do not see it. No. Is it over here somewhere? No, I don't know. Okay, we can figure this out though. Got it. There we go. Edwalski. Okay, we picked up a bathroom key. Uh oh. Oh, the game went weird. Oh. I wonder if that's supposed to happen? Is that like a feature? Like your your vision's messed up, or is that just the game being poorly optimized? That was interesting though. What just happened? It is a demo. There's whispering coming from the bathroom shower, of course. There's a loading bar to move the curtain. Oh, hello. Gnosis. G-N-O-S-I-S. G-N-O... S-I-S. You gonna see the shadow across the hallway? I did, it was a guy, but my, uh... The screen went all weird. G-N-O-S-I-S. -S. That'd be cool if you turned here and saw him there. That'd be awesome. There's a photo here. Okay. This makes me feel uncomfortable already. Do I take it? How do I take it? Ah, take. All right, let's deliver this photograph and get that gate key. Go! Run! Okay, let's go deliver this photograph. And then he'll give us a key, we can go get our sister and get out of here. Point, Emma had better hope I don't find her. She better come out of hiding, like, come on, it's not that serious. I gotta slide it under the door. Oh, he opened the door. Oh, hello? That's the guy we saw earlier. So he was watching us at that house. Hello. Damn it, I need that gate key. Okay, here's a mirror here. Hold on, let me go look at the guy first. He has a uh, some kind of weapon there and he's got one in his hand too. Do you happen to have the key you said you'd give me? Okay. There's some bread here. Big nope, that's a bone saw. Wonder what he's going to use a bone saw for. I'm just looking for a key. Did you hear that? Uh-oh. 
he moved. <laughs> There's a painting in the shower. Why is there a painting in the shower? Ah, uh, damn it. <laughs> okay, he's still chilling there. Something's moving. He's behind me now. He still has two bone saws. <laughs> Why'd you bring both of them? Is one still in the wall? I'm curious. Does he have three bone saws? No, he has two. He took it out of the wall. Okay, you better stay there. Why do you have mannequins in here? Ooh, tarot cards. Uh-oh. I have to put these in some sort of order. Seems to be locked. The beast sits in the corner of this long forgotten land. One strolls furthest and above him, fragility in hand. Neither above or below the two a soul swings bare. Galloping up high, a dark omen can't help but stare. A soul pain in thought lays furthest from the pale. While two souls between darkness await bells and veil. So that's obviously the, uh, the key for the tarot cards. Where's the freaking key, dude? You told me you give me a key, not have me solve your tarot card puzzle. Alright, so... B sits in the corner of this long forgotten land. One strolls furthest and above him. Fragility in hand. Furthest and above him. So the beast has to be down here at the bottom. I guess that'd be the devil? Where's fragility in hand? Would fragility in hand be the fool? He's got something in his hand. Oh, I keep pressing escape. The beast sits in the corner of this long forgotten land. One strolls furthest and above him. Fragility in hand. Hey, Erica. Neither above or below the two, a soul swings bare. Galling up high, a dark omen can't help but to stare. Neither above or below the two. A pain, soul pain and thought lays furthest from the pale, while two souls between darkness awaits bells and veil. This is curious. Very, very curious. Don't know. We'll get it eventually. Maybe. Me, uh, let me reset. Yeah, you just missed Erica. This guy is sneaking up on us. He has two bone shaw, uh, two bone saws, and we had a jump scare just now that happened. Now we're in a room full of creepy mannequin. He's right outside, and we have this tarot card. The beast sits in a corner of this long forgotten land. One strolls furthest and above him, fragility in hand. Neither above or below the two, a soul swings bare. Neither above or below the two. How can it not be above or below when there's two sections and like it has to be above or below. Neither above or below the two. Oh, you mean it's in its own row. I gotcha. In its own row, like not above it. I see. In the middle. Galling up high, a dark omen can't help but to stare. Hangman in the middle. So maybe the hangman is here. It says galloping, the hangman uh, can't help but to stare. The horse. Maybe he's staring at the hangman. Maybe the devil's over here, the beast, and the fool is furthest away, but above him, right? It says here, one strolls furthest and above him, fragility in hand. 
A soul pained in thought lays furthest from the pale, while two souls between darkness await bells and veil. While two souls between darkness. A soul pained in thought lays furthest from the pale. Is it like this? No. Maybe it's the other way around. Hmm. Oh, not that. The swords in the bottom right corner and lovers in the middle. Swords in the bottom right corner. Lovers in the middle. But the devil, the, it says the beast is furthest and below. It says here, the beast sits in a corner of this long forgotten land. One strolls furthest and above him, fragility in hand. You said, now put death back where it was in... Flip the fool and the death. Okay, fool and death. Hey, nice one, Erica. Okay, he's still not there. What did I unlock? Something unlocked. Oh, maybe it's the door back over here. Don't you move. Is this unlocked? It's locked with a thin metal chain. Use the bone saw. Oh, the door is locked here. Oh, we're locked in. You know your turret? Nice. Okay, we appear to be locked inside of here with this guy. What am I looking for? Something happened. I'm not sure what. Oh, this is open now. I see. Uh, you plan on playing any more of coin game in the future? Maybe an episode or two. There's not too much more of the game. Until an update. Uh-oh. What's happening here? Ooh, I like the heartbeat. Oh, he's, he's getting up. Hello. Why are you pretending to sleep this entire time? Uh-oh. Uh, okay, so it does appear that the, the camera stuff is on purpose. Oh, no! <laughs> uh, hello? That photograph you found is very important to me. Okay. You didn't have to help me, but you did anyway. I won't forget this. Uh, alright. Cool. I'm gonna leave now. Why are you standing on top of the bed? An event has changed your fate. Get down from there. What are you doing? First you were menacing and now you just look ridiculous. Okay. That'd be cool if he followed you out. Ooh, I did a little bunny hop right here. He still has this. Oh, I cut the metal chain with pliers. Can I leave? It's locked now. So I guess I do go through here. Oh, here's a key. Oh. What are you doing? Why? What is your obsession with getting on top of furniture? What a weird little man. She shouldn't be in that house. Okay. I don't understand his obsession with furniture. He's like a cat. Well, that was creepy. Let's find them and get out of here. I love that the protagonist is just like, Well, that was creepy. Okay, here we go. 
Find Emma. How did she even get in here? How did- wait, how did Emma get in here? If I had to get the key from that creepy guy, how did she manage to get in here? I bet there's no, like, hole in the fence or nothing like that. What is the purpose of this, either? Just break it off right there. Maybe it's because he's short, I stand on stuff because I'm short. He's gotta... He's gotta stand on stuff to be eye level with me. <laughs> he's like, now I can look you in the eye. Okay, Emma. Emma! Where are you? Why are there candles lit here? Who's lighting all these candles? On the floor, especially. Okay, there looks like a girl and looks like a death figure. And there's a whisper. This is boarded up. Won't be able to take these boards off with my bare hands. Can I do it with my human hands? If I can't use my bare hands, maybe I can use my human hands. Because I feel like if I actually pulled on this board, it could come away from the door. It's not even nailed in. There's not even a single nail. Okay, I picked up the lantern and now we're at a cutscene? Oh no, it's not. It's just got dark. I thought it was a cutscene because it was so black. <laughs> um, and use it. Yeah. There we go. Why did it get so dark all of a sudden? How'd that happen? Yeah, if I can't use my bare hands, I'll just use my human hands. Not a big deal. Chessboard. Should we go towards the creepy crying or away? Hello? I'm, I'm looking for my sister. Oh. I'll come back. She's clearly not here. Okay. Hello? Oh. Oh! There's a strange device here. Huh. I'm not sure which way the arrows go. Okay, there's nothing to really... There's nothing to really suggest where they go that I've seen yet. Ah, here we go. Okay. Uh, the times of their deaths. So there's a spinning wheel. Oh, these are execution methods. There's a spinning wheel, which is the first circle. The second circle is the chopping block, and the third circle is the stocks. Okay. Gotcha. Times of their deaths. Well, how do I know when they died? There's gotta be something else that we haven't found yet. The times of their deaths. Oh, here we go. A model of the breaking wheel. How do I know what time they died, though? We see the models. There's one model. Is there another one back here that we didn't see? 
We might have walked right past it, not knowing what we were looking for. Can't leave. I can't leave this uh, Emma in a place like this. Why not? She got in here on her own. She can get out on her own. Okay, I don't see any other torture devices. All I see is that one. It says the time of their deaths. Just looking at the device didn't really show me much. Is there a clock next to the room? Oh, there is. So you think maybe this is related to this clock. But this clock is like which... Would I put it on the hour? Would I put it on the... Minute? Model of the breaking wheel. This is cool, they would uh, attach you to this wheel and break your bones. Till you died. Hit you in the chest as well. Let birds pick off your corpse. It's a little after 12. Was it 12.40? No, 12.35. 12.35, but I don't think... I don't know how that helps me with the inner circle. Where do I put that? And which one is it? Is it the blue? Is it this one? No, no. Oh. Come on. Open back up. There we go. Let's head upstairs. Let's see what she wants. Hello, ma'am. Seems to be jammed. Won't be opening this. Hello? Over here, she said. Okay. Well, she knows where she's going. Over here. Oh, okay. Is he spitting in that girl's face? What is he riding, a cat? Could one wheel be hours and one be minutes? Maybe. Yeah, there you go. So do you think the bigger one would be minutes and the other one would be hours? The smaller one would be hours? So this one is uh, 1235. So the big hand is on 35. Oh, and the... Let me see, which one is it? The... the small one. So this will be on 35, and this is, like, right here. Pretty much. Uh, uh, depends. Hours are larger, but ends of time, but the hour hand is actually smaller than the minute. Yeah, so it could go either way. So either the hour hand is a small one, because hours are smaller on the hand of the actual clock. Or... It's the mid other way around, but it's 12.35 on the first one. We know that. Damn it. Let's go find the other ones. Stop it. Let us go find these other ones, shall we? So far, I haven't seen another one. I was a little distracted by her, but I don't think I've seen one. Oh, look! It's a donkey. Donkey. Yeah, I don't see another one yet. Hello? Okay, a little bit of music. Oh, we have the uh, planet system. Okay, I saw the... Um, I saw a poster for that downstairs. Solar system. Planet system. <laughs> but between the wheels look uh, like on a digital clock. But you have the between the wheels, like on a digital clock. There's a piano. And there's music here. It's locked. There's no place for a key, though. Yeah, there is. There's a place for a key right there. What are you talking about? Obviously, it has to do something with music. All right. Oh, let's see. Mercury. 
Venus, Mars, or Earth, Mars. Wait. Earth, Mars. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, wait. Jupiter, Saturn. Pluto's not a planet. There we go. Can't open up this one. No? So what did I just do? Ah! Key. Okay, we got a bathroom here. Nothing down there. Why did we gain access to the bathroom? Oh, here we go. We have the guillotine. So this is... 955. 955 on the guillotine. Let's go back. Let's go put 955 down. So the guillotine should be the middle one, I believe. I like how they have a poster here in case you forget in what order the planets go. Come on, how are you going to forget what order the planets go? What is it? 9.55. So right now we're doing this one minutes. And then this one will be hours. Six, seven, eight, nine. We might switch that around. I mean, once we figure it out, we'll know one way or the other. There you go. Hey, Jess. Hope you're being safe. Jess is going to a concert with her girlfriends while I stream. I wasn't invited. No, I'm just kidding. It was a hundred bucks. So I was like, Oh, I got a crowbar. I was like, no, nah, you go have a girl's night out. Okay, what do I use the crowbar for? It seems to be jammed. Uh, no, it's not for that. What do you think the crowbar is for? The door in the first room. With the boards? Oh, true. The boarded door that isn't nailed up and that you can easily remove. That got me a little bit. I was not expecting that. That was very loud. Get out. Is this the s I mean, you can't. <laughs> you can't get out. There, I got him off. Okay. Ooh, another puzzle. I do enjoy these puzzles. Oh, it's a actual puzzle. Okay, uh... Why can't I put this here? There it goes. I was like, why won't you stay there? Boom, and boom, and boom. Get all the... Now the middle. Fill it in. Easy. Oh, I thought something was gonna appear. Okay, so now we got the script so we could play the piano. Ooh, hey Patricia. Was this... Was this on top of the table earlier? I wasn't paying attention. It still says get out in blood. Just give me my... S there she is. Okay. That looks creepy right there. I like that. <laughs> That's a cool image. You just see hands and a head floating up. 
what concert? There's a few bands. I don't like the crackling sound. That's not good. Ooh, spooky. So far, this demo is very promising. I'm very looking forward to the full game. Oh. Hello? Very much looking forward to the full game. If this is the demo. Okay, let's go ahead and place this down here. Time to see if those piano lessons paid off. It just so happened to have piano lessons. How convenient. Do do. Very nice. This is just a demo? Yes. This is just a demo, but there's two other games that we're going to be checking out today. And it's all by the same developer, Vincent Laud. He has a bunch of horror games that are kind of short, but cheap and fun. Which I'm all about. Scary, cheap, and fun. Sometimes the long, scary games can get kind of drawn out and become less scary. But usually the short ones that have some time put into it are actually pretty scary. Okay. Music door unlocked. Here we go. Here's the last one. So this is at 5.15. 5.15. Trust this place. Something's going to happen. Oh! What does that mean? Get that symbol off. It's dark. Okay, good. I knew something was going to happen. Let's hurry up. 515 on the last one. So, this would be 15, and this would be 5. Nope! Okay. So, it's the other way around. 15. This would be 5. Uh, the middle would be to, what? 35, and this would be 9. No. 11, 35. So this would be... no, 11... 5, no, 45. No, this is 9. Jeez, 9.55. So 9, and then 55. And then this one will be here. And then this one will be here. Right? No? Did I get these messed up? I think I got them all messed up. What do these little glowing dots mean? Okay, let's try again. Let's see again. This one is 12... 12.35. Was that at 12 before? Oh, you know what? It is 12.35, but... It should be 12. There we go. I was trying to get the pos- I knew it was 12.35, but I was trying to get the positioning right, but it was 1. Uh-oh. Uh... It just froze. Okay, there. Thank God. <laughs> I was like, no! What happens? It is locked, there's no place for a key. Oh, hold to enter the basement, sure. What could go wrong in the basement? Uh, 
Okay. Oh, it's loading in a little bit, sort of. You can see the, uh, f I can see over there. It's still in early access. It's not out yet. This is just, well, not early access. It's still the demo. It's got some love still needing put in there, but it's pretty good. I'm kind of impressed. Kind of impressed thus far. Oh. Drag. There's looks like there's no power. Well, that sucks. Okay, let's head this way. I hear move it. Uh oh. Emma. Emma. Stop playing, Emma. Hey, Dark Ember. Emma, stop playing games! Swear to God. A uh, long, dark hallway. I love it. Someone blew out my lantern. I do not appreciate that. Don't do it again. Oh, I see the wall. <laughs> I think it was one, two, three, five. No. What is this? Oh, I have to equal this number? 120. Wait, what? 120, 50, and 122. Oh, times. That's 120. Uh, 120. 120. 120 plus 2? Times. Not times. Wait, wait, what? Is that 120? So 10. Uh, that's 20. Wait, 120. I'm confused. Is it multiplied or what? 120? 122? How do I get 50? 8 times? I mean. Is this. This is times as well, or is this plus? This is plus. No. So, 122. Plus something. The first two in multiply equals 120. Yes. Yes, for sure. This is 122. So this would be 12 times something is 122. 12 times... Is it 18, right? No, not 18. Or 12 times 6? No, that's not it. 14 is... Oh, wait. Or is it 120 times... 120 times something is 122, or plus something. 120 plus 2 is 122. And then this is 2... 2 plus something plus something. 2... or maybe not 2 times 1? No. Is that a plus or a times? It's so hard to tell if this is a times and this is a plus. I guess this is... is this a times? 48. Nice. 2 times 1 plus 48. There he goes. It's a little weird to see if it's a plus or a times. I think that needs to be like a little drawn better. Okay, we have power now. Oh, look! A cupboard! Just out here on its own. Was it was it like that before? Seems to be jammed. Okay, let's go ahead and drag this. Uh-oh. Okay, cutscene.
Oh, fancy. A fancy secret hiding place down here in this basement. Okay. Something's going to pop out of there now. Oh, now's the time if it was going to pop out. Okay. Maybe not. What's this? What do you think it is, lady? It's a secret passage. It's like you've never seen a secret passage before in your entire life. Ooh, this door looks interesting. Ah, oh, it's jammed. Oh. High volt. Oh, are those a pair of eyes looking at me? Is that a pair of beady eyes in the darkness right there? What is that? Hello? This looks like a church. These are like pews. That's a chair, a torture chair. You're chained to that with spikes. There's pig heads everywhere. What the hell is this place? Oh, okay, it's not eyes. It's not eyes. There's just a, a torture chair and there's a puzzle here. That's crazy, I like that. It looks like eyes in the darkness. Just staring at you. Okay. We're all good. There's been too many rumors surrounding the historical society lately. We need to move Lasilla's body in case anyone comes looking around here. The ceremony will be done in her home, but it's too far for one trip. The house of the drunk, the one Lucilla took us to, we can move her there. It should still be empty and no one has heard from the owners in years. Move the body at night and do it quickly. Disguise the wagon as building supplies for the pathway restoration project we've been funding. You'll be able to travel out of the village without suspicion. After finishing preparations at Lucille's house, we'll move her the rest of the way. Okay. Ooh, a puzzle. I like puzzles. What is this supposed to be? Oh, I know. It's supposed to be like a pyramid. Ah, oh, come on. Get out of there. This goes on this side. There we go. And then this one goes on this side. Nope. Come on down. There you go. And then this one goes over here. Got him. That wasn't too bad. So, what happened now? What did that do for me? Must have unlocked something. Let's go check it out. Oh, that's nice. Oh, how inviting. Sure. How lovely. Must be motion sensor activated. It's jammed. Another cupboard. Oh, look! They're like satanic. Cool. Cool. Ooh, an Iron Maiden. And some cages. These people are freaky. So many torture devices. I hope Emma's not in the Iron Maiden. 
Volunteering our blood doesn't have the same effect as it did with that man. Start with drifters or anyone who's not from town and keep it quiet. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Emma's not from town. Can't go inside. <laughs> this book looks creepier than the others. Maybe it can explain what's going on in this place. Maybe. But for now, I need to get out of here. I thought you needed to find Emma. That's the whole reason why I haven't left yet. Time to leave. I don't think it's going to be that simple. What was that? Did Emma just walk out of there with the pig mask on? Okay. Emma. Uh-oh. Emma. I'm gonna go upstairs, I think. Oh, this is not the way upstairs. Oh, god damn it! Emma, <laughs> Scare the crap out of me! Down here? I saw you open the basement door, so I followed you down here. Get that thing off of your face! What are you doing? You shouldn't have snuck into this house. What are you wearing? It's a pig's mask. I found it in that weird room. There's a bunch of them. I was just trying to scare you. Well, you did it. You did it. Just take that thing off and we can talk about this later. Let's get out of here. You succeeded, Emma. Good freaking job. Damn, it's gotten so late, and this storm is so much worse. Guess we better st uh, guess we better stay the night in this house. Let's not risk taking a shortcut and just go back the way we came through the pasture. This is only one area. There's the pasture still. What happened today? He's stressed out enough. The pasture sounds so scary. I want to do the pasture. Okay. That sounds like Texas Chainsaw-ish. No need to go back in there. Oh man. I should walk with Emma so she can keep up. She's keeping up just fine. <laughs> I don't need to walk with her. She's like the best escort mission I've had in a long time. You better not stab me in the back. I don't feel comfortable with you walking that close. Can you like... Can we do like six feet apart? Look at the way she's staring at me. Like she wants to murder me. She looks like someone who would murder her sister. <laughs> I don't know. I don't like it. I don't trust her. I do not trust my sister. She's freaking me out. I forget which way it was. I think we started over here. I like how she asked who lit all the lanterns, but she's not concerned with who lit all the candles and put them on the floor. Okay, there's the exit. I guess I should have assumed. Looks like he even left a card. Thank you again for retrieving that photograph for me. I'll be seeing you soon, my dearest friend. That's nice. What a nice man. Enter the pasture. I imagine that's the end of the demo, right? Oh, I wish you would take that thing off. You look like a doll. Okay. I'm not comfortable with people looking at me. 
Oh, maybe Lucilla is his mother. Did you go into the historical Or someone society? related to him. The basement was open. No, no. It was two girls. One snuck in, and the other went in to get her out. Did they really get into the basement? Yes. Two girls? A family moved into that old farmhouse. The one close to the parish could be them. They were playing a game. Maybe they didn't see anything. We can't take that chance. Call the others. We're going to pay them a visit. Uh-oh. They're gonna pay us a visit. The Witching Hour. Thank you for playing the Witching Hour demo, a small part of the complete story. That was fun. All right, that's really loud. I'm going to turn that off now and let's go to the next game. That is really fun. I'm definitely looking forward to the full release of The Witching Hour. I definitely have that in my wish list now. That was an excellent game. All right, next. Another game by the same developer. Let's go ahead and check it out. It's called The Swine. Let me go ahead and get it up on the screen for yous. Yous guys. All right. Another game by Vincent Laid or Laud. Okay, so here it is The Swine. Let's take a look at the options. No blur or no, I guess Bloom's okay. Bloom could look nice in some games. Graphics, let's go with very high. Skin weight, four bones. I don't know. What does that mean? What does skin weight mean? I don't know what skin weight is. I guess I'll keep it on normal for now. Yes, my skin weight is four bones. Okay. Mm -mm. Bought Planet Crafter because of you. Thanks for the new addiction. Planet Crafter is so good. The only issue is the end game. But I'm a few. I'm almost done with the game, so I got about four episodes left. And then the fourth episode, I'll give my. I'll do the end game and my final thoughts. All right, let's begin a new game in this game called The Swine. Here you go, Erica. Another tar tarot card for you. The Fool. Monday, 8.45 a.m. Hey there. About time you woke up. I'm going to take a quick shower. Can you start breakfast? Sure thing. While you were asleep, we had a visitor this morning. There's no one out here for miles. Who was it? A young woman. She looked a bit dirty, to be honest. Oh, her car broke down? Maybe. She asked if she had permission to enter and to use our phone. I said, sure. But she didn't end up using it when she was in the kitchen. I wish you didn't let her in. She sounds like a drifter. Maybe. She left shortly afterwards. She also gave me a card, and I thought it was a business card, but it's some kind of drawing. I left it on your desk in the living room. <sighs> Already a great start to our week off. Okay, that's weird. So, she just invited a girl over, and the girl asked to use the phone, and she didn't use the phone and just drew something? It's a bit strange. I guess, are we a painter as well? The artisan set. Oil paints. Okay. This is, uh, this reminds me of the Visage a little bit. Or not the Visage, but Visage. My girlfriend Amy is in the bathroom. I don't want to disturb her. Why not? There's a lot of books. 
An abacus. Okay, we can open up drawers. Anything of interest in here? There's like a little notebook. Can I open up these drawers? No. Oh, yeah, I can. Okay. Well, that's something I wasn't able to do in that demo. Another cupboard. We got candlestick holder. Not, I can't open up these. Watercolor. You just gotta look at it a certain way, I guess. Hmm. All right. Visual quality can be changed under graphics. I understand. Can I turn the light off? Oh, cool. Save electricity. I hope that vagrant girl didn't touch anything. Okay, I'm gonna turn off the bloom a little bit because I think that's too much right there. Still looks pretty crazy. Okay. Nothing in the drawers. I'll watch TV after breakfast. Okay. A strange visitor. Is the bloom still on? No? Huh. He crouched? Yes. Tab to open up my inventory. Thoughts. A strange visitor. Some strange girl visited the house today, apparently to use her phone, though she didn't seem all too interested once inside. My girlfriend Amy said she'd left some kind of card with her before leaving. It should be on my desk in the living room. On my desk in the living room. Alright. Whoa! I felt like I was going to fall down. We have a basement? There's nothing I need in the basement. Oh, that's creepy. Dawn Quick... Quick go... A friend gave me this one, was saving it for the holiday. No need to use the downstairs bathroom. So you have a downstairs basement and a downstairs bathroom? That's interesting. Ooh, that looks some nice bread right there. Pizza! That reminds me of a ranch simulator. We got some crispy breakfast cornflakes. What am I supposed to do to start breakfast? Okay, where's my desk? Cicero. Uh, Cicero. I'll do some yard work later today. Where's my desk? Desk. There's more paints. They said in the living room. Okay. There's a lot of books around here. Oh, here. Okay, I got a tarot card, but I don't see a painting. I just see a tarot card. Wine. Wait, what? What's happening? Oh. Let's give me some like... Some like A24 vibes. A little bit. I'm getting a little bit of A24 vibes from this game so far. Like Midsummer. Honey, wake up. It's freezing in here. Tarot. Mm. The power's off. I'll check the circuit breaker in the basement. Uh-oh. I should get the heat and lights back on. I think the lantern is still in the large dresser with the rest of the storage stuff. Okay. Was that director's name that directed that? Artie or Airy? Something like that. Who directed Midsommar? He's a really good director.
I thought she was in bed with me. Lights out. My girlfriend's in the- she's always in the bathroom, holy crap. And look, the bed's like- are we sleeping on top of the sheets or what? Ah, uh, yeah, the circuit breaker. I should get a light before leaving. Where did they say the light was? Should be in like a drawer, I imagine. No? There's a light- oh, there's a cup there. Oh, a lantern. Here we go. Use. Just like in the other game. Why don't I have a flashlight? How is this light on? Okay, let's go check the basement. Obviously nothing's gonna happen down in the basement, right? I hear footsteps. I just heard footsteps. Hello? That'd be interesting if the door was open. Oh man, that'd be crazy. Can you imagine? That'd be pretty good. That'd be chill vibes right there. I get chills. Hello? Is there a light on back there? Okay, it's not this way. There's a drawing here. Flowers and four black birds. Or crows. Okay. Huh. Nothing- oh! That's not good. What are you doing here? Who are you? Who are you? That's supposed to mean. I don't want anything from you. <laughs> what is that supposed to house? mean? What is that supposed to mean? You just moved all my furniture with your mind. What is that supposed to mean? Go away. No. I understand. I understand. What do I understand? She's like Darth Vader. Okay. All right, Darth Vader. Oh. It's like that movie, The Strangers. They've infiltrated the house now. Oh, look at that guy over there. It's a home invasion. Hello? Uh, oh, there's four of them. Over there. I know what I need to do. They're all staring at me. What do I need to do? Oh, I have to go upstairs. Look how creepy they are. Alright, let's go upstairs. 
What do we have to do? What do you thought y'all think we have to do? What are we gonna do? Are we gonna do something to Amy? Oh man, this game is cool. This is another good one. is killing me. Did I turn the power back on? I don't remember coming back to bed. Hey, Mantra. Honey, there's a strange smell coming from downstairs. Can you check it out? I can't find where it's coming from, but it gets worse by the basement door. Okay, this is this is interesting. I like the style that they're going for. It reminds me of uh, the director name I'm thinking of is uh, Ari Aster. Ari Aster has movies that are kind of like that, like Midsommar. Amy's in the bathroom again. <laughs> the girl lives in the bathroom, dude. I'm telling you. Hey, shooter. Oh, was I able to get here before? The Nightmare on Chando Street. Death Bloom. Power on the VCR. Death Bloom is his other game. Might have to check that out sometime. Okay, where am I supposed to go? Maybe told me something smells terrible downstairs. Maybe from the basement. I should check it out. Damn, my head is killing me. Silent thrill. Is that a face? Yeah. That's a picture of a person. No, I'm going through each day. Each day is different. It's cool, something creepy will happen, and then it'll be like, boom, next day. Alright, let's go check that basement, shall we? Lights are on now, so that's good. This is where they came in earlier. I don't see anything down here. Macbeth. And I'm not sure what would cause that smell. This is where... There's a fire. There's some kind of fire going on. Weird. Oh, there's another door. No, that door is just leaned up against the wall. I'm not sure where the smell would be coming from. It sounds like there's a fire outside. Maybe the bathroom? No. No, nothing in the fridge. I expect to see like a pig head or something. Oh, here's the fire. There's an axe. That's weird that you can hear the fire from the basement. It's a little strange. Okay, I need to stay home. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure where the smell is coming from. 
Is there like a cupboard? No. Since here, Amy told me something smells terrible downstairs. Maybe from the basement. I should check it out. Okay, I'm in the basement. I don't see anything. Hmm. In here? No. What is that smell? Oh, a tape! Oh! Okay, let's go watch this VHS tape, shall we? I was wondering how we could go into this room and turn on the TV and stuff. Here we go. Uh, play. Okay, is this our house? There's a window up there. This is like sinister. Okay, we're looking into the window. That's our house. That's our couch. They're looking in through the blinds and the windows. Oh. Four, seven, three, five. Four, seven, three, five. Okay, that's it for the videotape. Now, what do I do with that? Where do I put that in at? I didn't see any locks. I kind of like this. It's like a slow burn. Is it downstairs? Is there some kind of combination down here now? I don't see nothing. I see green garden peas. Four, seven, three, five. Where do I put that in at? Let's look around. Nothing in the bathroom. I don't see anything in the kitchen. Looks nice outside, though. Four, seven, three, five. Nothing. The drawer is stuck. Can't leave. Four, seven, three, five. Notebooks. Nothing down here, from what I can tell. Let's head back up. Hello? Amy is still in the bathroom. Holy crap. I don't have any objectives now. Four, seven, three, five. Maybe there's something in the room. I didn't pay attention to it. Crime and punishment. Perhaps there's something in here. No. Where could it be? Nothing there. 
nothing here. Did the videotape reference any locations? Oh, we can see outside. Oh, look in the garden. I see. There's a keypad to the garden. That's where it is. There's a shed. 4735. Interesting. How do I get out there? Here we go. Ooh, this looks nice. This is a house we need to watch. It appears to be a man and a woman. They seem to be in a uh, sound body and mind without much connection to the outside world. We need to know how isolated they are out here. They are the most viable out of all the houses we've been watching. Alistair will be quite pleased if this goes right. Okay, they've been so they've been watching other people too, but we are the most vulnerable and the most viable. Quite interesting. So they're targeting us. Let's get inside the shed. See what we can find. Granted. There's a pig mask. And there's an axe. Oh. I remember now. God, my head is killing me. I can't do this. No. I have to. Those things that girl said. I can't let them happen. I have to do this. I heard breath. I hear breathing. Do you hear that? Who's breathing out there? Oh, maybe they're inside the house now. I have to do it. Here they are. I know what I have to do. Tower. Amy. Amy. Where are sleeping. you? Are you sleeping? Amy, come out here and take your medicine. Hey, honey. Did you find out where that smell was coming from? Friday, two days later. Hey, Alex. Yeah, we played uh, one other game that was really good, really scary, and now we're playing this one, which gives me some Midsommar vibes. Did I have a nightmare? This air is so heavy. I feel like I'm gonna be sick. Why? Why would I? What did that creature say to me? Who are these people? Every time, I start to remember, it slips away, like someone turning a light on and off. I lock the basement door. Something's not right down there. Hey, here we are, Friday. Two days later, did we kill Amy? What happened? I see my shadow. Clouded thoughts. I was in the basement last night and the night before. What was I doing down there? My clothes and hands are so dirty. The bathroom door is locked. 
Looks like there's a struggle. A little bit. Amy. Is that a ghost orb? Ah, there's a pig head in the fridge. I knew there was going to be one eventually. This makes sense. Okay, someone busted in. It definitely looks like a struggle. Alistair is getting sicker by the month. He'll need a new body sooner than expected. I don't know why we can't just do this now. The chariot. chariot. He said the vessel must be willing. Be more patient and wait for the correct moment. Ah, so we are the vessel for Alistair. Oh, look at that guy in the woods. Are you going to be gone after I take this key? No? An old key? I can't remember what it opens. Oh, look, I'm not, oh, look, they're all around here. Oh, they're sneaky, hiding in the forest. There's one there. I see two right there. And I see one right here as well. They're all staring at me, waiting for the moment. Okay, we got an old key. I wonder if this opens up, oh. I wonder if this opens up the bathroom. Or is it the basement key? It might be the basement key. He said the basement's locked. He locked it. That's the smallest amount of blood. Uh-oh. Hello? Toilet paper! Can I open this? How do I open this? I want to see what's inside. We got a lot of towels and a lot of toilet paper. Hello? I don't see an, uh... Like a button. What am I missing? The mannequin's up here. I hear crying now. Was that Amy? Amy, what's going on? Why are you crying? I still hear whispering. No, I don't see it. I don't see where to open up the shower curtain. Maybe we go downstairs? I heard her crying. Oh, damn. Ah, here we go. Something's missing from the door. I don't think it's going to open with the key. Something's missing from the door. That's all I remember. What is missing from the door? Something is missing from the door. Maybe now I go upstairs and then it's there. Maybe I went too fast. Long hair. 
Something is missing from the door. I don't recall what was on the door before. Yeah, there's nothing I can do up here. What is missing? Let's head back outside. They're still waiting. What? I don't understand. The door isn't budging. It almost feels supernatural now. I don't think it's going to open with a key. Something's missing from the door. That's all I remember. And I got this tarot card here. Tarot. Sorry. Tarot card. I'm not sure what I can do with that. If I can do anything. A tragic scene. I can't say it's not cruelly fitting. Combinable. The tarot card is combinable. Okay. It says 9.15. So would I put the tarot card? Can you use the card on the door? Maybe. Combinable. I don't, maybe not. Maybe I combine it with something else. Does not let me... Context menu. It's not letting me do anything right now. Let's turn on the light. Oh, tape! Okay. Some tape from the tool shed. Also combinable. Okay, we got tape. And we got a tarot card. What do we do with tape and a tarot card? I'm looking around slowly. Nothing. Okay. Can't use the pig mask. No. There's a knife there. I'd rather pick that up right now. Let's see. Open. Drawer stuck. Stuck. Tape the card to the door. Oh. Combine. Ah, here we go. Ooh. Oh, there's a bloody axe here. Did I take her into the basement? Oh no. What have I done? Amy. Look at my leg. Look at my leg. Saturday. Seven thirty one PM on Saturday. I understand now. I was a fool. Okay, that's all he's got to say. Oh, Amy. We killed her. Transformation. I spent all night in the basement. What did those pig-faced people do to me? Was it because of those cards? That kind of magic shouldn't be real. Here's another tarot card. Said it right that time. 
The Ten of Swords card. That doesn't look good. I feel like that's a bad omen. I'm no tarot card reader, but I imagine that's not good. The door is gone, or was pushed away. Who removed my door? I guess I was there all night. Uh-oh. The fridge is gone. Who stole the fridge? Come on. Oh, it's blocking the upstairs. Jeez. Ripped off the stove door. Come on. Is all this necessary? You rearranged all my furniture? Lit a bunch of candles? Hello? I did what you wanted. I know they're out there. Okay. Ooh, a letter. Uh oh. The vessel is ready for Alistair. Make sure the others have made appropriate arrangements at the church. Oh, God! <laughs> I was not expecting him to run after me. Holy crap. <laughs> Is this my vessel? No. He looks plenty ready. Prepare the ceremony. Oh, man. So there's Amy, the axe, and me. Here's a ceremony. Transfer my spirit upon this vessel. Let the left hand embrace and nestle. Oh, that one looking at me sideways. Best correct yourself. He is too. Have their spirit break and pine. Let this body bend and become mine. Oh, damn. Casting a spell on me. Oh. That was pretty good. So far, two really good games. I enjoyed that, um, the artistic and the story in that, uh, how each day was a new day and how things escalated. And you saw him becoming more insane each day. And, uh, like, you knew you murdered Amy, but it didn't show it immediately. I like that, too. Very cool. Very cool. Alright, we got another one. Thank you for playing. Vincent Laud. So far, these are cool games. Alright, let's do this. Press escape. You press escape. Alright, that was a dollar on Steam, by the way. That was a dollar on Steam. Next up, time for some Hawthorne, or not Hawthorne, ha Heartthorn, I should say. Here we go. The last one today. <laughs> These are pretty good so far. 
I'm definitely going to be checking out more by this guy. He has... I, I'm excited for that, um, that last, or the first one we played. That should be releasing soon. We're going to have to play the full game. Okay. New game. Morning Shift. Gotta yeah, press that any key, I keep forgetting. Hawthorne High School, winter break 1994. Okay. Doesn't seem to do anything. Main office, I'll check morning. it out later. You're the new guy, right? Ah, uh, morning. Yep, that's me. You're my safety and security dispatcher. I'm April, but also yes, I'm your dispatcher. I'll be checking in with you while you do your rounds. Have you worked as a security guard before? No, it's a first time thing. I recently moved here to go to university and Needed a job in between classes. Not that I don't appreciate the opportunity. But you sounded a bit on the younger side. And don't worry, I'm not your boss. I'm just here to check in with you from time to time. Ah, uh, well, that's good to hear. The orientation was a bit on the brief side, so it's good to have someone help me out. It's a quiet town. All you need to do is just walk around and try not to have a tea party with one of the science room skeletons out of boredom. Thanks for the tip. I honestly don't mind the quiet here. It's peaceful. It's peaceful because it's winter break. <laughs> when I attended Hearthorn, it was far from it. You're a local? Yep. Born and raised. Radio me if you need anything, new guy. Okay. Will do. Thanks, April. Okay. Start your rounds. Teacher's lounge. Open your inventory to see task items and view controls and settings. The next route on my rounds leads to the storage room in the northwest section. Okay, so I guess I'm just peeking inside. Here's a utility. The basement. Ooh, that looks creepy. Classroom C. All good in here. Can I go to the washroom? No. Okay, principal's office, no. I need the storage. Can I check out the classroom? Nope. Art room. I'll check it out later. Art room. Another hallway here. There's another art room, huh? Yeah. And then basement, I imagine. Stairwell. Locked. Classroom B, classroom B, there's a gym. The front door of Hawthorne, or Hartthorn. Hartthorn? Where is it? Classroom A, no. No washrooms. Storage. What's that? I heard a noise. Okay. There's a lot of TVs in here, mannequin. Okay, this is weird. Breaking at Bestboro Armory by Bob O'Boston. Hawthorne tennis champion underway. Okay, interesting.
All right. Next on my round, art room. Northeast. Or southeast. Northeast. Art room was back over here. Art room. Wait. Starting to get next on my round. Uh, next on my route ends at art room storage. Art room storage. That is art room storage. Art room. No, this is a storage. Okay. Oh. Okay, now we're at the evening shift. Guess we're getting a feel for the layout of the building. Another radio? Start your rounds. Start by going to the infirmary. So here we are. The infirmary is just over here. Just down here is the infirmary. It sounded like some chairs moved. Am I here by myself? Infirmary. Okay. Hey, how's the evening shift? Hey, April. It's going good, it's just... Just doing my rounds and staying on schedule. Yeah, I'm bored too. Have you explored much of the school outside your rounds? Drug storage? Not really, no. You should go check out the basement. Oh. I should? If you do, I'll tell you a story. If you're sticking to your schedule, you should be close to it anyways. Okay. I'll check out the basement. That sounds fun. I actually used to be in the pep squad for our basketball team. The Hearthorn Cobra. Here it is, right? Really? No. Are you in the basement yet? Yep. Ah. I'm almost there, I think. Oh, that looks interesting. Okay, I'm in the basement. Okay, I'm in the basement. What do you see? A gate and other things typical of a high school basement. Go to the room on your left. It'll be worth it, I promise. Oh, this room. Okay. I don't see how this is worth now, it. What do you see? A boarded up door? Want to know what's on the other side? Sure. Maybe. This is getting a little weird. <laughs> it's part of the original school. Half the classes used to be down there before they built the new wing. We used to call it the dungeon when I attended Harthorn. The dungeon. Well, that's grim. I had math and history down here for three years. That's grim. After the new part of the school was finished, they moved everyone upstairs for renovations. Okay. So, why is it all locked up then? True, good story, or good question. <laughs> so many rumors around Hearthorn on why they condemned it. I've heard things from the school hiding a crime that took place there by a disturbed former art teacher, to a pipe bursting causing water damage and black mold with no school funds left over to fix it. That last one being the least exciting, but probably most accurate one. A disturbed former I'm, art teacher. I'm inclined to agree. But for now, it's off limits to everyone. So, what do I do now? I may as well look around while I'm down in the dungeon. This place creeps me out, though. Yeah, I'll look around. Locked. Oh, there's shoes under here. Oh, okay. Hello? This only opens up a crack. Can I see above? That'd be cool. Get up on a toilet stall in a scary game. Shit! Ah! Okay, it got me. <laughs> even Why after the fact. even have mannequins? Why are there mannequins in the oh, toilet? Sewing and textiles class. They make clothes for some projects. 
I made some overall senior year that we won't be talking about. Also, if you need batteries or anything for your radio, it'll be kept down here. There was an issue with theft in the past, so electronic stuff is kept in the basement. Batteries okay. are in the basement. Noted. Thank you. It's getting pretty close to the end of your shift. I need you to grab some keys before you leave tonight. Yeah, sure. I've had enough of the dungeon anyways. What am I doing with the keys? Barely lasted one night down there. As part of the security package for the school, we're updating Hearthorne's rusty locks to keypads, keycards, and other fancy things tomorrow morning. That sounds pretty high tech. It's 1994, new guy. Times are a-changin'. Okay, so where do I go? Fair enough. Go to the reception office and find the main set of keys for Hearthorne. Something keeps moving. Alright, where is the reception? Reception, reception. Where would that be? Right side is art. Left side is... There's the main office, teacher lounge. Maybe it's on the other side. Here's the infirmary again. Is it down here at the main office? I imagine so. I imagine the main office is reception. Was it here? There you go. Hey, uh, hey Jeff, or Geoff. I uh, figured you might find this if you're cleaning Hartorn during the winter break. It's probably just the pipes, but I've been hearing some metallic noises coming from the basement. I know no one's been down there in years, but could you go down and take a look? If you're not comfortable with going past the gate, I totally understand. No staff wants to go back down there again after last time. What happened last time? Okay, let's find these keys. Ah, here. I got the keys. Awesome. On your way out, just leave them in the company truck for the technicians. We always keep it parked out there, and they have their own set to open it tomorrow morning and grab them. All yeah. right. Night, April. Nighty night. Day one completed. Oh, we got a late night call. I thought we were done for the day. Hello? Hey, it's April. You're on call tonight, right? Nope. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm up. What's up? The alarm at Hearthorn is going off. Can you drive down there? The installation guy's probably wired something wrong, but we still gotta check it out. Yeah, sure. I'm on my way. The new key is hidden in an old school bus in the woods next to the school. The technician had to leave late and needed to put it somewhere. And it's not like he could leave it under the doormat. That seems... unorthodox. No offense. Don't let our fancy logo fool you. We're... quite an unorganized company. <laughs> right. I'll let you know when I find it. Okay, so... alarms are going off. Now we got called in. We're at the school grounds. Okay. It looks like a figure right there, almost. Okay. An old school bus. Shouldn't be too hard to find. Ooh, a lantern. Can I take this? No. Why is there a random lantern out here? Another lantern. Okay, it's leading me into the school. The path toward Hawthorne. I know the school bus is right there. Alright, what am I looking for? Open, very slowly. Ah. 
Is there anything else in the school bus? No, I can't go back further. All right, I'm going, I'm going. Park's so down, uh, so far away. Down there, down the path. Oh. There's a loading screen. I was like, I pressed open. The South Wing. Press any key. Let's do that. Here we are. What do we got to do? Can you hear me, April? Investigate the alarm. Loud and clear. I grabbed the keys from the old school bus. I'm in the Hawthorne now. All right. The alarm went off somewhere in the southwest wing. Check the map if you ever get turned around. Southwest. So we're over here. Use light switches to help you. Where's the light switches at? In here. I don't see none. A whole bunch of different... Oh, lights. Right here. But I can't... I can't use this at all. Okay, here's the southwest. Oh, there's candles in here. And a note. Okay. Increasing security in Hawthorne. We've taken the concerns of staff in consideration as as a precaution have instructed our security company to start char uh, changing the locks around Hawthorne. We also have a buddy system of teachers walking to their cars in pairs when school is back in session after the winter break. Uh, not to sound alarmed, Greg, but are you sure he was released early? He wouldn't have known it was us that spoke to police, would he? Yes, I was informed he was released last month. Some of the evidence was inconclusive, so he was only sentenced on the lesser charges. As for him knowing who cooperated with the police, I can't imagine him thinking it would be anyone else than his fellow faculty members here at Hawthorne. Which is why we are taking preliminary precautions. I can't believe they let Victor out after all we told the police. I taught history at Hawthorne for 21 years, and three years he worked here was the first time a student went missing. And it happened twice. It's not a coincidence. The art he used to make in his classes should have been evidence enough for the poor state of his mind. Those three years shocked everyone, I assure you. And as I said previously, the evidence was inconclusive and we're taking precautions. Let's keep cooler heads, Miss Scott. So it was a disgruntled art teacher that had two students go missing within three years. And they called the police, but there wasn't enough evidence to keep him away. So he's back. Wandering the halls. Where's the lights? It told me there was lights, but I, don't, I haven't seen one single light. Okay, nothing here. Try the girls' room. I think I found what set off the alarm. The window in the girls' washroom is busted. Oh, man. <sighs> Damn. Protocol says to investigate first, then contact the police if necessary. Probably just some kids anyways. Light switches are outside the room? Ah. Hey, April. I sort of noticed something. What's up? The window was broken in the girl's bathroom, but there's no glass on the floor. It gave me the impression that someone broke out of the school, not into it. Oh. How did someone break out of Hartthorn? True, true. I don't know. Something to do with changing all the locks? I think you might be working yourself up. Makes sense to me. Search Hawthorne for anything suspicious. Sure. Okay, another storage. This is back at the storage.
Is that newspaper again? Okay, nothing else suspicious over here. Seems to be stuck. Huh. Okay. Uh, it says light. There's no lights over here, though. Ah, oh, here we go. Okay, that door is stuck over there. The gym is locked. There's a note next to a candle in the storage room. I saw the newspaper. I didn't see a note. Let me go check again. Oh, here. Lost count of storage room inventory. 17 monitors, 9 basketballs, 7 boxes of toilet paper, 4 boxes of Hawthorne Cobra jerseys, 32 bottles of cleaning solution, 11 boxes of light bulbs, 6 baseball bats, and a bunch of the other boxes I'll count later. Okay. That's not a big deal. It's a bunch of boxes. Interesting. Whole lot of boxes. Everything else seems normal. Nothing crazy going on here. Let's head this direction. There's a book, but the classroom seems fine. There we go. You think some things are missing? I don't think I'll be able to open this. This looks like a workshop. Whoa, this is the art room, isn't it? There's a painting here. That looks nice. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the art room. Sketchbook. Nothing else here. Here is the art room storage. Oh. Nice. That goes into the art room. Okay, cool. How's the investigation? Going good. Oh, another candle. I'm by the principal's office. Great. After replacing most of the locks, the technician left the master key card there. Take a look around. Well, let me read the note. Hey, Greg. Figure I could come or should come in here and leave the spare jump key somewhere for you to dispose of. I put it in that fancy locked box in the art room. Seems fitting with you know who out of prison, eh? The combination is in the no storage room. The master key card anywhere. Strange. Some doors might still be used with the original locks. Keep an eye out for any old keys. If you're done with the south wing, go to the north wing through the gym. Combination is in the storage room, literally. Just read the three lines with gym equipment on the inventory seat. Okay, three lines with gym equipment is a combination. And the key is in the lockbox in the art room. Gotcha. So we need to get the three lines with gym equipment. Three lines with gym equipment. Oh, the basketball moved a little. Three lines with gym equipment. Basketballs. So nine. Nine, four, six. Nine, four, six is a combination. Okay, let's go. Nine, four, six. They said in the art 
right? Or is it art storage? I don't see any combination here. I think it's art storage. Nine four six. That's a principal office. Interesting. What did he say? Nine four six. Where was it? I can open up all. Oh, here it is. Okay, how do I do this? Q to examine. Oh, here we go. Nine, four, six. Okay, we're in. There's a key here. Okay, I got the gym key. Let's go inside the gym. Here we are. Okay, cutscene. Make good progress. Gymnasium. Press any key. I got. Oh, it's a nice gym. gym now. Cool. That door to your north will need to be open. April. You cut out at the end there. Things are fine on my end. Did huh. you touch the frequency? <laughs> Could be the weather, honest. Shit. I was supposed to replace the batteries before dropping off the keys yesterday. I remember her saying they're kept in the basement with the electronics, which is in the north wing anyways. <sighs> okay. So, now I need to go to the north wing. This seems to be locked and I can't get in through this way. So I guess I have to go back to the north wing in the, to the basement, right? Go Cobras! Yep, okay. Oh, wait, what is this? The gym floor is completely wrecked again. It's the air ducts. They go all through the school and something is leaking through them. I can only replace boards and mop of water so much. We need a contractor to come fix the duct system and stop it from dripping. Probably not going to keep, uh, be cheaper, uh, to be cheap, but cheaper than replacing the whole basketball court. I'll leave the maintenance key here in case someone comes in. To give us a quote. Hawthorne's Cobras will spend more time twisting their ankles on warped floors than winning uh, anything at this rate. Okay, so we got the maintenance key. There we go. Climbing up. Is there another little cutscene? Or it's just taking a second? And now it's just nothing's happening. Come on. Climb up the ladder. Press D a few times. Do it. Climb up it. Uh oh. Please don't be frozen. Please don't be frozen. Hopefully if it is, we don't want to start over. Uh, escape. Well, it's not frozen because I can escape and do stuff. Weird. Oh. Oh, you gotta climb up. You gotta press up. I thought it was, like, stuck. Oh my gosh. You have to press W. I thought he would climb automatically, like a little uh, crouch, gotcha. Like a little cinematic or something, or cutscene. Uh-oh. This is crazy. Yep, that does not sound safe. We got a little bit of a maze here. Let's take a left. And let's take a right. Oh. And then right again. Don't break. Stay intact. We're 
We're almost there. Oh, oh. This is going to collapse under me, right? Okay, here we go. We're inside the duct. We're ducked in the duct. Ah, here it is. North wing. Oh, dang. Hey, KB, welcome to the Vent Texans. Oh. Appreciate that, buddy. Can we get some Lady of Loves and some hearts down in the chat? Appreciate that support. Welcome, welcome. That's very generous of you. Thank you for becoming a member. Where am I supposed to go? I'm in the north wing. You can continue investigating. I should probably fix that vent cover before I leave, though, and never tell anyone I did that. How do I fix the vent cover? I can't pick it up. Okay, that's not happening. Locked. Locked. I don't think the technician would do something like this. Who would board up these doors? Nothing in here. Hmm. We're supposed to go to the basement, I believe. Okay, another mannequin. Oh, a note. Hey, Greg, some corrosive materials went missing from the utility room last week. You know if anyone's been poking around there lately? Normally, I'd assume it was those little bastards, blessed though they be. But with it being winter break and all, I've considered it, or I'm consider, concerned it might be a member of staff. Not that I'm accusing anyone of anything. I understand your concerns, Jeff, but I, uh, uh, Jeff, but I received a number of emails about missing supplies around Hawthorne, and we're taking extra measures with hiring a security company and updating our locks. Also, though at times appropriate, please don't refer to the student body as bastards. Yeah, probably not a good idea in a professional workplace. Okay, this is locked. The basement's locked. Seems blocked from the other side. Okay, we have like a little lounge area. There's another book over here. Teacher lounge is locked. All right. Oh, that guy has a large sickle. Don't make too much noise. Stay low and quiet to avoid detection. Running can be a last resort. Is that quiet enough? Mm, you're not alone. Where'd he go? Infirmary. There's no way that way. We checked back in the infirmary. Ooh, there's a pin code here. We need some kind of code. Some kind of code somewhere. Nothing here. Okay. 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 Get the batteries from the basement. Radio April. You wouldn't let me go to the basement earlier. Another note. 
Those boys in the North Wing washroom are up to something. I'm locking up their little gossip club until I figure out what is it they're up to. Okay. Let's continue to walk or crawl, I guess. Crouch. It's locked. Hmm, boys washroom. Says he locked them up. Someone patrolling with a giant sickle. Maybe I have to go back the way I came now. He said the boys' washroom. There's a lot of papers on the floor. There's the pool table. This was locked earlier. Okay, still blocked. There's a basement door. But it wouldn't let me open it last time. Yeah. Locked. This just goes around. He said the boys' washroom. Maybe I should go there. It's right up here. Oh, it's blocked. No, that's not it. That's the girls' washroom. There's the boys'. No, the boys' washroom's locked as well. Locked. What am I doing? All the exits are blocked or locked, and there's no going back through the air vent, so I'll have to get into the basement and look for batteries to radio April and contact police. But what do I do? There's a combination. Just gotta do something with the combination. I can't get into the lounge. Hawthorne. Nothing here. No indication what that combination might be yet. Let's go back through this door. Is this... No, it's a classroom. This is not the infirmary. Yeah, I don't see nothing. I don't even see the guy. Can you get in the boys' washroom through the girls' washroom? Maybe. That's a possibility. Maybe if I go back to the vent? He said I can't go back to the vent. Huh. Anything over here? No. Where is the dude at? We we'll try the utility closet one more time. Maybe there's something I missed. Oh, here's a key. Oh my gosh. Boys washroom key. Wow. I can't believe I didn't see the key. I just read the note and that was it. Now we can get into the boys washroom. Alright, we're just crouching around, minding our own business. No big deal. No one's behind me. 
Is he gonna do something scary over there by the boys' washroom? I think someone's coming. Who's coming? I'm hiding. Okay, someone's coming, they're not here. I don't know. It's quiet. I guess I dodged him? I feel like the music's getting more intense. Okay. Boys washroom. Over here on the left. Here we go. There's shoes there. Seems locked from the other side. Seven zero four eight. The code for the drug storage room. Only take enough that nobody notices. What? Okay. Seven zero four eight. This feels like a long walk down this hallway. Okay. Oh, there's a mannequin out in the middle. I see it. All right. What's going to happen? What is happening? That's why I just asked. I'm gonna go around a mannequin. Seven zero four eight is a combination that we need. Let's go this way. Here's the infirmary. The light. Okay, lights are on. Seven zero four eight. All right, here we go. Okay, we made it in the drug room. Hey, Nurse Garland. Hope the winter break is treating you well. Do you still have the contact details for a contractor that built the gate for the drug storage room? Hey, Allison. I can find his information when I go into Hawthorne next week. May I ask why? Just out of curiosity. I went to the chemistry class on the second floor two weeks ago. Noticed some chemicals missing from the back room. With what we have in here, it should probably be locked up anyways. Sorry to hear that. Hopefully it wasn't just mis- or hopefully it was just misplaced. Hopefully, though, I ran into the shop teacher, Harold, last Wednesday, and he said a, a spool of wire went missing from his class as well. I think a few teachers have been coming into Hawthorne during winter break. Could be worth passing on that contractor's phone number to the group email in case there's been any other missing school supplies. Not sure why we even pay those security people. Okay. 
Is there like a key or... Oh, I can get back here now. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Is there something in here that I need? No. Ah, here you go. Teacher lounge key, okay. Oh! What do you want to do, huh? You feeling froggy? You ain't gonna do nothing. Okay, we got the teacher lounge key. Let's go around. He's gone. Where did he go? Oh, he chopped up the mannequin. That's rude. Why would you disfigure the mannequin? What did that mannequin ever do to you? There's a the teacher lounge. Uh. Oh, I thought I heard his footsteps. All right, we made it. What am I looking for in here? I'm not sure. Nothing. Nothing. Oh, card. Picked up a key card. One of Hawthorne's new key cards. Oh, where does a key card go? Okay. Let's... What was that? I'm not sure. Okay, we have a key card. Oh, those desks are disappearing. So it's not gonna go to the basement, that's for sure. Key card. Hey, there we go. I didn't realize there was a key card pad right there. We can still go upstairs. Huh. Let's go down. Open. Okay, we're back in the basement. Okay, here's that storage room again. And there's another door here. The boards are gone. Oh! I did not expect them to... Run at me and break my neck. Unknown. Okay, that's scripted. I thought I did something wrong. Hello. He's running fast. Jeez. A security guard? So, it was you that changed the locks. We didn't have strangers like you haunting our hallways when I taught here. What are you doing here? I could ask you the same thing. For me, Hawthorne is sacred. It's where I did my work. It's where I stayed close to my canvases. But all that changed when they all conspired against me with the police. They even had the audacity 
to bring my artwork to the courtroom as a reflection of my deteriorating mental state, but their orchestrated attrition against my work didn't make me any less pious. It only gave me more resolve. What? You're who the students rumored about? That's none of my concern. Or yours, for that matter. Your attempt to lock me out of Hawthorne locked me in. But no matter. Nothing's changed as far as I'm concerned. I still have time to finish my latest project. One that will turn Hawthorne into an installation of broken bricks and twisted metal on the first day back. With those traitors entombed within it as a monument to their conspiring against me. Oh, he took off. Okay. He pulled a Batman. Can I move? Condemned North Wing. So it begins. I need to get out of here. Ooh, I busted out of the chair. Nice. Okay, anything here for me? No. I gotta go this way. Okay, now what? Bathroom? Ooh, hello, flashlight. Art? All right. There's a snake over there. Hello. I heard you've been coming into Hawthorne uh, during winter break. Have you by chance seen our trusty janitor uh, GF around at all? Hey, Greg, can't say that I have actually need to pass on a message to him if I do. No, that's fine. It's just that I left a note for him to investigate metallic noises coming from the basement a few days ago. Never heard back from him. Since the incident, I hate sending anyone down there. I see your concern, though. I'm sure he's just busy and will get back to you soon. I guess if you're sure, it's all the assurance I need. Locks. Okay, jammed. Then this is obviously nothing we can do here. See you run at me again? I hear moving. Are you behind me? No. Those are the boxes. There's a nice looking horse. Okay. We open that door. Where does this take us? The library. Okay, more mannequins. I know you're in here. Yep, here I am. Sneak through the library. That person's dead. Okay, there he was. Hey, Smoke Whiskers. Oh, shoot. He was close. Just sneaking through. If you wanted to kill me, why let me go in the first place? Like, you could have just killed me right then and there. Picked up the library key. Oh! Leave me alone! 
Got it. Get out of there. Go. Okay, we made it. He was right behind me. Holy crap. I didn't expect him to be right there. Too bad he skipped leg day. No cardio. I need to get those batteries or find a way out as soon as possible. Why can't I use the batteries in my flashlight? Ooh, well, look at here. That's interesting. Batteries, got it. April. April, can you hear me? You forgot to replace the batteries last night, didn't you? Call the police. There's someone here in Hawthorne. Oh, shit. On it now. Stay on the radio. Are you alright? Uh, I think so. I think I'm okay. He's been in the basement of Hawthorne the whole time. The whole time I've been working here. He's been here, too. Stay calm. Where are you? In the basement. I'm locked down here. I went down the stairs like the other night. Okay. There's two stairwells in Hawthorne. Can you make your way to the other set? Yeah. I, I can do that. Get to those stairs and go out through the front door. I'll be on the radio with the police. She's in on it. I don't trust her. I don't trust her. She's working with them. A lot of cages. Oh! Pig people. I get deja vu looking at this card. Seems stuck. Okay. Why do I get deja vu looking at the pig people card? Or the fool card? Maybe that's just reference to his other game. Oh, look, there's a uh, another another little pipe here that I can turn. What'd that do? It's opening and closing something. Okay, what's over here? Duct tape on the mouth of the mannequin. Great. No head, no hand. Ah, another pipe. Pipe wheels, turn it. What is this doing, I wonder? Hawthorne High School. I think someone's coming. Okay. I gotta do one more, it looks like. Here's another door. April, you said last night there were rumors around Hawthorne about a former art teacher or something. Here we go. Yeah, there were. The story is that a missing student was found in the basement turned into some That's kind it. of art installation. That crime would have destroyed Hawthorne and the town's reputation, so... The faculty scrubbed the scene, and the court rushed the trial to cover it up. That rumor has been around for years. Oh, he's right there. Since they locked up the basement. What are you gonna do? It's true. Let's just focus on getting you out of there. The police should be close. He ain't gonna do nothing. He's all talk. All bark. No bite. I ain't scared of him. Yeah, you better leave. Keep walking. That's what I thought. Got it. 
Now what? Uh, studio. Okay, that's not the exit. Come out! Come out now! Oh, okay. Since you're so convincing, I'll just go ahead and come on out of here. Well, let me just get on out of here then. Ooh. Oh, God. April. Does the police department have There's a lockbox? What? What? I need to get these boards off. Claudia Blanc, 16 years old, missing. Hello. He's just strolling. Strolling all cool, strutting his stuff. Where's he going? That's a lot of explosive. Mm -mm. Hey, Hoss. 291 was circled where? Uh-oh. Oh, on the... On the girl's picture. Oh! Frig off! Oh yeah, 291. Nice. Try and get to the lockbox. Oh, there he is. Uh oh. There he is. No, open it. Rotate. It won't. Oh, I have to hide the cursor to rotate uh, cursor to rotate it. I'm trying to take it. It's so annoying. You have to show the cursor to click on stuff. You have to hide the cursor to rotate it. Got it. Ah, oh, that's annoying. I got the hammer. I could use this to break the wood. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He's coming after me! Oh, shoot! Oh, shoot! Get out of here! Go! No. It's busted open. Oh, okay, there we go. Okay. Made it through. Another cutscene. Easy. Been a minute for me, life. Yeah, no worries. This is our third scary game today. I like the uh, the first two were really good. This one's okay. So close. I have to get up those stairs. The first two were really, really good.
Watch your steps. Oh, IEDs. More explosives. I need to be more careful. <laughs> Should I step on this? Who has explosive pressure plates just lying around? This guy, obviously. Looks sealed with an electrical lock. There's no power. Can't get down there. Okay. Oh, we've seen that before. Guess these are little places to hide. There's an N with a circle. The other one was like a very curvy M. Strange symbols. One, two, and three. Okay, well I know where the, what the symbols are, I know where they are, but I don't know what you want me to do with them. Should I step on them in a certain order? Maybe. What's here? There's nothing here. Okay. Maybe I should step on them in a certain order? I like how the light switch is behind the board. Awesome. Okay, and there's that one. Okay, that's easy enough. You gotta have two brain cells to do this. So, M, that one, and then the N. Gotcha. Let me rub together my two brain cells. Watch it actually kill me. Oh, the timer's going! Oh, that one's stuck. I forgot. What? Oh. What? There's no way I had time to get to the other one. Retry. There's no not enough time. So close. I have to get up those stairs. Maybe I didn't run fast enough. More explosives. There's the end. Careful. This is nothing in here. This is just a dead end. And then this is the second one. That's strange. Maybe we should try it again. I thought I did it pretty okay. I mean, I wasn't winning any speedrun records, but... Go! Damn. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I'm sprinting. Full-on sprint. I almost got to the room. Hmm. Maybe you have to go to... Maybe it's not in order? So close. I have to get up those stairs. Did you leave things on the plates? Uh, do you leave? I don't know what I could pick up. More explosives. I need to be more careful. I don't think I could pick anything up. Maybe I can go even faster. All I have is flashlight. That's all I got. OK. 
Okay. It's a lot of frag grenades. Maybe we should try one more time. Go, 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 go. Oh, I hit the corner of the trash. I ain't gonna make it. Nope. I don't even know if I did it as smoothly as possible if I'd have time to make it. That's so fast. I'm so close. I have to get up those stairs. I know, you keep saying that. Let me open up the doorways. Here we go. More explosives? I need to be more careful. Are there any shortcuts? I don't think so. I don't think this is a long cut. Right here. I think I'm going the shortest way to that second one. Because first we have the M. La locked. I should examine that note. First we have the M, then we have the Omega, and then we have the other one. Or not not the Omega. That's the, um, those are ast uh, astrology signs. Let me do it again. Who knows? Maybe I was going a little too slow. Oh, I skidded on the trash again or whatever. I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing. Nope. Wait, did you pick up the note? What note? It said just examine the thing. I can't pick up notes. I could just uh, read them and put them back down. Read the note and put it down. I'm so close. I have to get up those stairs. I already read this earlier. The uh, Anarchist Bell Book Fundamentals of Explosive Ordnance and Improvised Explosive Devices. That's all it says. That's it. I don't understand. They said this door is stuck. Seems stuck. I don't know if that would help me really get all that much faster. I mean, it it's, seems like it'd be about the same. There's no way to get through there. Uh, the note on the other door was just a sequence. Nothing here. So here's the other one. Maybe you can pick up parts of the mannequins lying by the uh, plate? Maybe. Yeah, this looks just like the sequence of events. Oh, I can pick it up. Can I rotate it? Oh. Nice. So, three... Three, one, two. So this one, that one, and then the Omega. Okay. Not sure if I should trust this. I should inspect it more. Yeah, someone would definitely say that. Oh, wrong way. I died. Oh, I didn't die. Go. Oh no, I didn't open this door. Okay, I made it. I was like, nope, didn't open the door, I died. You lied to me. How dare you? Electricity is oh is someone shooting? Who's shooting?
Okay. Next. Final encounter. This can't be happening. Pick up the gun. Yes. Okay. Um uh use Why don't I use a flashlight as well? I need ammo. Where's the ammo? I need ammo to reload it. Hold on, he doesn't have any ammo. Okay. Maybe I can bluff my way. I'll shoot! Can I really do this? Well, I don't got no ammo, so no, I can't. Is that the way? Yeah, that's the way. Wait, maybe there's ammo down here? No. Where is the ammunition? I would like some ammo, please. I've been planning this for years, you little punk. I'm not going to let you ruin it. You little punk. Another maze. Yeah. You little punk. You believe you called me that. Oh no. I shot him in the head. What the heck? This guy is supernatural. I was surprised. I thought shooting him in the head would definitely kill him. Little did I know that's not his weak point. I planned on you shooting me in the head. Little did you know that is my... That's not my weak point. Do you feel lucky? I don't. Can I really do this? Yes, shoot him. I've been planning this for years, you little punk. You little I'm punk. I'm not gonna let you ruin it. All right. Come on. Come on, you little punk. How did those miss? Ah! Help! You little punk. Come on. Run away! He's right after me! Okay, he ran out. He ran out of stamina. He got a little tired. He's all tuckered out. Time for a nap. Got him! Got him, easy. Oh, my bullets are floating, or the gunpowder. Okay. Ooh. Aww. <laughs> I'm gonna put the gun away. 
Oh no. Use it. I don't know what happened. He shot himself. Police! Uh -oh. Down on the ground. Police! Down on the ground. Safety at last. Oh, so it's a loading screen to a end credit screen. Oh my god, are you all right? Okay, no. <laughs> yeah, I think I'll be fine. So, I guess this is our first real introduction. He's really calm for having killed a man. Sorry, it needed to involve you almost being killed. But, you know, I imagine she would be a bit taller. <laughs> It's nice meeting you, too. Haha, <laughs> let's have a good time now that I killed a man. Okay, the first two were amazing. This one, no. <laughs> this one was a no. They can all be winners. Unfortunately. I mean, it's not his first time. He acts like a sociopath. Definitely a psychopath for sure. Probably both. You don't just kill someone and be like, ha ha ha, it's nice meeting you. Uh, main menu. Nope. Okay. All right. Well, those are the games I had for you. Those are three scary games by uh, Vincent. Vincent Laud. Now that that one was not his best work. The first two were amazing. I think particularly the second one was my favorite. It was very short and sweet, but it was pretty awesome. Um, and the first one is actually that we played was a demo. So we're going to be playing that when it fully releases. Uh, let me see. Does that have a full release date? It's called the witching hour. That's the demo we played. It says May 2022, so it should be coming out next month. So definitely something to look forward to. We will be checking that out, Witching Hour, next month. But I hope you guys enjoyed this stream. I appreciate everybody showing up. Thank you uh, for being here. Thank you, KB. Shout out for that membership. If you did enjoy uh, the videos today, go ahead and hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. Check out the Twitter and Discord down in the description. And then I will see you guys next time. Have a good night, day, afternoon, wherever.